everybody, I'm Cheryl, and welcome back to Cheryl's Corner. <laughs> yeah, I'm here today to show you my Ipsy bag and my new Choi box. Hmm, yes, so we'll just get started and we'll start with Ipsy. Now I haven't looked at mine, I've been watching some others yesterday and the day before and the day before that and mine's been sitting here waiting to do this and yes this month's saying is summer 11 and it comes in a little baggie like this all different multicolors and a cute mostly with a teal colored zipper and inside we have a Vasanti Brighten Up Enzymic Face Rejuvenator with papaya and micro crystals and aloe. And it comes in a little sack like that. I'm not going to open it. We'll go through all of that some other time. Also, I have a uh, lipstick called Read My Lips by the Tease Company. Comes in a little box like this and then you open up the box. I haven't seen this. I haven't looked at it or anything because I didn't want to compare it to anybody else's. And this is what the tube looks like. And does it have a color? It's called Killing Me Softly. Yes, it's called Killing Me Softly. And it's sort of... Hey, that's not too bad. It's not even showing up bad in my webcam. It's it's a pinky color. And I'll try swatching it somewhere on my wrist. And on my wrist, it almost looks a little bit on the orange side but of course in my webcam everything shows up red and we'll try the white paper trick again mm. it still looks kind of red or maybe that does help it look pink I don't know you tell me also, we have an Ofra eyeshadow and highlighter in the color Bliss. And it's in one of these little plastic thingies that you can put in a metal container type thing that you can put in a Z palette. And we'll swatch it on my finger. And it is a goldy color. Yes, it is. Oh, I don't know. I might like that. That's really not too bad. And swatching it on my wrist under the lipstick. And there it is. I think. Mm -hmm. That's not too bad either. Oh! And I got a little pair of pink tweezers. Yes, a little pair of pointy angled pink tweezers by Crown. Yes, that's who they're by. And also there is a Octavio, uh, Octavio, 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 Octavio sea salt spray infused with algae extract and no because the other way there it is and we will open it and <sighs> did you smell that <laughs> no it's got a clean smell that's nice that's nice that's that for Ipsy. Now for the Choi box. And I'm new to this. 
I was watching a couple of other gals here on YouTube, Olivia and Michelle. Hmm. Oh, yes. I watch them all the time. No, they're some of my favorite people, and I get all these ideas from people, and then I just have to have the stuff. So it's all their fault. They made me. Anyway, Joy comes in a box like this, and mine came in a bag like this one. Another nice little white bag to use to demonstrate. No, it's got writing on the back. But anyway, another nice little white bag. Anyway, we'll go ahead and oh yeah, this this box is magnetic. It opens magnetically, and inside the box, and you get a card that. Welcome to Choi and hope you enjoy the experience card. Yes, and then inside there's two little things. And then this little thing here that's tied up that I had to untie is some little black sponges and some Q-tips and, and then a couple of little brushes and a little baggie there to use should you want to use them and I will have the prices and everything below and in case you don't want to look at mine you can go over and look at Michelle's and Olivia's they 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 they, they, they bleh, I'm tongue-tied today they've got codes for this too okay inside this box your makeups to try and I got the Dallas and Gabbana matte liquid foundation the natural glow 100 and the benefit hello flawless oxygen wow foundation in liquid ivory and i got the bobby brown corrector in porcelain peach and i also got the dior blush in vibrant vibrant color powder blush in lucky pink and I got the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Blush in Ethereal Glow. Okay. These two. These are my little samples of my foundation I got. This one is the Founda Benefit Foundation in Liquid Ivory. Can't wait to try it. Oh, yes. And this one is the Dallas and Gabbana. Oh, what shall I wear with Dallas and Gabbana? And it is in Natural Glow 100. I was a little scared to pick any kind of a color. So, yeah. It will probably be pretty good. Also, this little sample of the Bobbi Brown Corrector in Porcelain Peach comes in a little thing like this and when you open it up there's a little sample of it in there probably be mm, several days worth yeah I don't use a whole lot of corrector really but then I've got this uh, Dior blush and lucky pink and it comes in one of these plastic things like you can put in a Z palette and I really should have opened I'm gonna turn you off a okay. minute while I open this. We'll start with this part one more time. The Dior blush and lucky pink as you can see comes in a little pot like thing that you could put possibly in a Z palette if it had a little magnet on it and Lucky Pink. Oh, I shouldn't have used that finger. Lucky Pink. Lucky Pink. Is right there. And I shall put Lucky Pink over here down below some of these other sample swatches. Um, Oh, you can see it. See the pink? That's lucky pink. 
that's pretty good that's pretty good I like that and this other one of course you all know what this is Oh yes, the Hourglass Lighting Blush and Ethereal Glow. Yes. Let's see. Let me use a different finger. Of course, it's not going to show up anything but white. But I'm excited to try this because I've always wanted some. All right. That's it for my boxes, and as you know, they're all monthly boxes, and I'll have all the information below, and I also sometimes below have other coupons, codes, and stuff that you can use. And like I said, if you don't want to go buy mine, you can go over and look at Michelle from KS Girl and Olivia from Olivia's Makeup. And I'll have all of them listed below, too. Now, for a little update. My little update on some, on some things that I bought the other day. Oh, yes. The lipstick that I have on is the Rimmel Moisture Renew in color 150 Piccadilly Pink. I got it at Walgreens the other day. It's the neutral. I have it on. Mm. I like it. And yesterday, I tried this Rimmel also in the Provocate Lips 16 Hour in the color number 200, I'll Call You. And I didn't show it to you the other day, but there it is and on the wand it looks very dark but when you put it on it's not that dark of course it's going to show up dark on my hand of course oh this isn't going to be good but when you put it on your lips it's a nice pink and i gotta tell you I'm going to have a heck of a time getting this off my hand because this lipstick stays on. Oh yeah. When I used to work, I used to buy Revlon and, and some of those Maybelline 24 hour type lipsticks that are made like this with the gloss on the other end. They don't work half as well as this does. This hardly even comes out off with soap and water. I practically had to scrub my lips. <laughs> That's how strong this stuff will stay on. It's totally different than anything I have ever used. Alright, and on my nails, I used this Sally Hansen gel and I put on the Cadillac, it's a Cadillac pink, Cadillac or Cadillac or pink. And I've got it on. And yes, you know who, just saying, I used two coats of the top coat. And so far, I have not chipped. Now, the only thing I kind of don't like about this particular color is that it's streaked a little. Not a whole lot, but a little. So, yeah, I can't wait to try this little orange one. And also, here lately, by Sally Hansen, Sally Hansen, I have been using this nail growth miracle serum that kim smith had recommended in one of her videos yes that's what it looks like and it comes in a little dropper and i have been using it ever since she talked about it in one of her videos which was like a couple of months ago after i tore up my nails so bad and i think it's helping heal them up i do and I guess that's it for today. And 
in case you've been watching my TV back there, I got another Christmas movie in. Try to guess which one it is. Let me know if you guess. <laughs>